You know, I got to tell you this weekend, I've said it before, I was hanging with my, uh, my nieces in the United States of America, where a kid's menu pasta is a pound of rigatoni in a cream sauce plus eight air fried chicken McNuggets. It's crazy town. Anyway, um, my nieces asked me, hey, Ryan, Uncle Ryan, have you ever played Roblox? And I said, I think I'm too old to play Roblox. And they said, if you play Pokemon Go, you're not too old to play Roblox. So in case you were living a world uh, in the world that I was, where I, you think you're too old to play Roblox, you can st as long as you also play Pokemon Go, which apparently is a game for babies, then you can play Roblox. Nobody's going to make fun of you. Roblox stream confirmed. Oh, man. Um, hold on. What are we doing here? We're playing not the weekly. We're playing Expansion Pack 2. And we've already got the bets running. We're ready to go. I know how to play. Don't insult me, okay? Early game, let me make your life easy for you. You buy a hummingbird. Um, look, just because there's two of them, I will. You buy a hummingbird. You buy anything. You buy a strawberry. And then you just keep feeding strawberries. Strawberry build early is out of control. I will be a chunky leg. And do the chunky leg. I can't sing that, right? Didn't that guy... Um, uh, uh, go to prison for murder? Is that correct? The guy who sang, um, that's, that song? That was all the dances? Was that Shmurda? Did Shmurda do that one? Probably not. Okay, hold on. I, dude, honestly, give me a kiwi, and I'm, I'm loving life. Pop a kiwi, now I'm sweating. Free Shmurda? Shmurda, he's free, man. We already, we went over this, right? Shmurda's already, he's out of prison. His, his work here is done. We, we did it with all those Elden Ring bosses we beat. Okay. Not sweating. Not sweating. Um, the pill bug has changed. Upgrade shop tier. Shut up. Give the two, oh, no, no, no. It was just that we had so many of them. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> okay. Um... Now, we'll combine into the best. Toad is unbelievable. It's goaded. It's the best animal in the damn game. Uh, it's insanely good. And then there's a, you know, I'm also looking at this and I'm like, I actually think the stork can be kind of sick, but not at level one. Like at level one, I find it a little snoozy. But what if we, what if we ran sell me? Stork me, stork me. Let's let's just get a little different here. This is a little unusual by my standards. If we're if we're running a strawberry cough, you can take an Atlantic puffin any day of the week. No more strawberries. Ducks still kind of garbage here. Toads are so good, man. Like it's like an auto take. You have to take it. That's my rule. Weaken. Not necessary, but nice. Look at this. Okay. The toad is just insane. Strawberry cough. Good reference, right? The actual best British film of... Uh... Oh, we got to combine, unfortunately. The actual best British film of the 2000s, Children of Men. Yeah, you thought I forgot? I have to think, okay? I mean, if a puffin, you know, the toad's gonna no. It'll be able to give a, give a puffin a chance. Just give him a chance. Maybe we'll get a level two puffin next time. Shaun of the Dead. Shaun of the Dead's really good. I feel bad, but like the thing about Shaun of the Dead that makes me like not think it's the best British movie uh, of the last. 22 years is because I just I'm so sick of zombies that even something that lampoons the zombies is like too many zombies for me. I know it sounds crazy to say, but I believe it. Hot Fuzz is a great movie too. The, I, I prefer Hot Fuzz, honestly. Now, let me... New synergy just dropped, honey. You know what it is? Apply weakness to the two front units. Sell a stork. The bird can go soon as well, unless we get it to level two. Woodpecker that causes weakness to the front two units. Okay, cool seal. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Much appreciated. 
why don't you take one of these? And you level up. And then you become a strawberry cough. Okay, we're in a great spot here. We need a level two toad. Level two toad pops off. Like, this shit's already over. I mean, this shit is already over. But And we still got a pill bug. What the hell is a pill bug doing? It just exists. Level two toad, please. And you know what? Our toad is going to get a little strawberry cough. Roll me. I, you know, I, I wanted to see something I already have, but let's go five strawberries, and then our puffin will do 20 damage to an enemy unit at the start of battle. No unit. This automatically puts us 5v4. Please hit the seahorse. Please hit the seahorse, man. Okay, they hit the salamander. I don't know whether that's good or bad. Holy cow. Dude, this team is kind of out of control. It's not going to scale well. But that's okay. Okay, probably the pill bug can go first, man. But I don't really want a kiwi at this point. Don't really need any of this. I gotta think for a minute, man. Because we gotta think about how we're gonna... How we're gonna get out of here. Like, I don't think it's worth a two-cost apple here, considering we're also selling the pill bug. A second puffin instead? You lose four, five... But you would gain... I mean, you could always just put it there. If you had a... Because you're losing a strawberry friend as well. I'm, you know what? I'm sending it. Get out of here. I want to see a strawberry, though. I don't see one yet. That's that's okay. Nothing here appeals to me too much. Even... I don't think the cassowary is that good, but I do think the pelican means... We can take you and then combine, and I'm feeling okay about this. Always want that toad at the back. Level two toad incoming. I think the bird is not long for this world. I, oh, never punished. <laughs> it buffed the bird, didn't didn't it? It buffed the bird. Please shoot that pill bug. Oh, it shot the bird. That's terrible news. Hold on, though. Are we going to apply a weakness to this pill bug? We might draw. No, our weakness. Okay. It's okay. Now, this is important. Actually, I love the vulture build. It's This is not where we're going to do it, but I do love a vulture build. I would much rather have one more strawberry and then wait a turn for our woodpecker to pop. I can't believe Big Mean Bug did it, man. Okay, the buffs are still coming. This team will get us to six. I feel great. Just kill one of their big units, please. That's That was a Scaler. You've killed a Scaler. Skyler, you gave the money to Beneki. Okay, we're going to lose this round, without a doubt. <clears throat> Level me. This, okay. Now, out of all of these, you give 2-2 two, two per turn. You apply 2 weakness rate at the start, which I think is fantastic. Sell me. Give me a Velociraptor, without a doubt. Second Puffin, this is not the way. Buff your Puffin, this is the way. I understand we're not even, I'm not even worried about you. We're not at the Believer threshold right now. Just believe, okay? Hummingbird's doing nothing. Oh, so a 2-2 buff is just nothing to you? <laughs> Yes? Okay, fair. That's fair. Hold on, I've got coconut armor on my worst unit. I'm ready to pop. Okay, we lost. Pay out the doubters on that one. I honestly think... If you ran a linear regression on our Puffin, our Puffin was like C-. minus. I'm disappointed to say it, don't get me wrong. I think you still run Pillbug, man. I think you run Pillbug, Kiwi, Freeze Strawberry. Honestly, I put a 1-4 Cockroach back here that becomes a 2-4 next turn. I'll be an amazing husband. If, they, if you get Strawberries in your first shop, you just beat me. That's fine. Congrats. 
Don't make fun of me for selling a permanent tutu buff for a temporary tutu buff, okay? I'm just like more tired than I've ever been in my entire life. Now, you're going to get the buff because the cockroach, we don't want them to get permanent bonuses, even though they are better now. I would keep you around as a possible le level enabler. I would keep you around as a possible level enabler. I mean, I guess we're going freaking juicy pill bug here or something. I don't know. We can see you eating the hot dog. Every time when, dude, you know what? That's when Mouth was talking about videos and movies that make you hungry. When he eats the hot dog in that sketch, I always want a hot dog. Not even a good one, just like a, a gas station hot dog. I can like, I can taste it when he's eating it. Okay, level me first. That's, it's a nice level. Explain to me why the the leech is good for I I get it if you can create a hurt trigger. If you can't create a hurt trigger, why is it good? It takes 1 HP from something and gives it to itself. It needs to multiply or something, man. I think the leech is is garbage. It sucks. Okay, that's good. It's only good with Hurt Trigger. Um, many people have been saying this, myself included. Friend, Hurt, give it 1-1. One, one. I still think you're ass now, too, just for the record. I think the Koala is still ass. Works one time per turn. You are, you're ass. You suck. Get out of here. You stink. For the time being, sure. I'll take a Puffin it, just for mild snipes. I'm not interested in the Cockroach getting any stronger. We'll level up a Kiwi. Let's keep a Strawberry around. No birds is real hater energy. Like, I've rolled the shop about 20 times. We also... Not only do we get no birds. We've run into exclusively teams that are held up by birds so far. That's okay. No big deal. There's haters everywhere. Level me. It's not a great situation. Leecher's Paradise. False, false. You know what? That's pretty false. Let's let's buy a strawberry to make our puffin better, man. This is a disaster. We don't have any damage. At least they've got a leech, so they like they're on the same page as me in terms of idiocy. I hope we we won around. Holy cow! Now this is where it all comes together, right? I'm starting to think we go like big kiwi or something. It's like a I can't sell my Kiwi, it's like the only unit I have that's any good, man. I don't know why I'm buffed. I guess it's because I got no other options. I'm just not that interested in this, man. A bird, just in time. Thank you so much for your bird. You know what? Go ahead. I, I know I said I can't sell it. I have to sell it. Buff my Puffin. All right, whatever. Eat me or whatever. Uh, roll me strawberry. I don't think you should find yourself in a world where you're building around a puffin. Like, that seems pretty bad. But here we are. I don't want you guys to have... You know what? <laughs> I'm losing it. Come buy me, buy me. We'll sell you back next time. Oh, this Doubters, I'm just going to say congrats on this one. I feel like you've got some heavy congratulations in order. I do have to say that I feel like this is one of the worst like series of shops I've ever seen in my entire life. Okay, hold on. Well, there's something to, to say here. An anteater is like really good. I don't really want my pill bug to level up right now. Here's what I'm thinking, and it's not fantastic, but if we buy a stork, next turn we level, if we live, we level up the pill bug. It allows us to get a vulture, and then we immediately pivot to faint build. 
and it all becomes clear. Holy cow, we won a round. Now, Vulture. Or maybe, no, not Dove. Okay, Pillbug. Stork. Give other strawberry pets 1-1. One, one. Well, with no Vulture, I mean, that's such bad scaling. <laughs> but at least it's something. I guess, you know, it's that classic tale of the rabbit stealing dinner from the mailbox. You know, beggars can't be choosers. We'll buff the unit that can actually, like, do something with the information. Big snipe on the Cashew Levy! It's, it's okay. It's like a three for one, but it's okay, because the Anteater's going to buff. Yes! Okay, we're hanging. We're hanging. You know, it just goes to show you there's so much beauty in a game of soccer. Not interested. Not interested, not interested. All strawberry friends need a buff. That means the cockroach has to go and be replaced with something else. But it has to be something that has a good effect. God, losing these stats hurts so much, but I think you gotta try. Two anteaters could fuck as well. And then they would make a little baby anteater so cute. Non-subscribers or non-survivor fans are so confused right now. Would you describe them as being as confused as a goat on AstroTurf? This seems horrible. All right. We kind of like came back a little, but we'll pay out the doubters there. I'm just here to tell you, it's like the worst starting shops I've seen on pack three in my entire life. No bird is just like, like go to hell. You always freeze a strawberry. I'll run two cockroaches. I don't care. And no bird. That's fine. You know what? Anything getting summoned or pushed? Probably not. Then let's run a pill bug. Run the casino. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Run the casino. There you go. Uh, crunchy cucumber. Dude, honestly, if I'm being honest with you, cucumber, I never had a... Okay, free wins. I never had a concept that a cucumber was an underrated vegetable because I grew up eating it like almost every day. I still want a bird. I'm not going to buy the mouse. I want this strawberry to make sense. Make it make sense. And we're going big pill bug, I guess. I feel like you you never... People... I, I didn't realize until I was... It's another free win. I didn't realize until I was older. People have very strong negative opinions about cucumbers. I love a cucumber, man. I think it's delicious. I think it's fantastic. It's crunchy. It's just water. Yeah. I love it. I love water, too. I got nothing against it. You know what I'm thinking here? Believe it or not. Combine, combine, prospective jellyfish, and a bird as a helper. The bird will buffet us a little bit, Warren style. We sell the kiwi, get a buff, roll a puffin. Maybe, just maybe, we level something up. All of a sudden, the jellyfish is maybe getting a little action. Not much, but a little action. Man's still running iguana build. Like it's 1985 out here. Okay, nothing wrong with that. Believers. Level me. Not interested in, a, in an old copy, but that's okay. I don't really want to buy you. I think we would rather sell you at some point in the near future. Roll me again. I see a bird. I love a bird. Let's get a bird closer to leveling up. Let's also make... Um, like, a bird is going to stick around longer than a cockroach. Let's buff the puffin by buying a strawberry for our bird, and then the bird will be guaranteed to hit the pill bug, which is what we want to see. We should have worked around our order there. Our pill bug is going to buff some units we don't really need to exist, but it's okay. Okay, this is an incredibly strong team. You just take the L on this one. It's a lot of birds. I'm not sweating it. Cucumber underrated sandwich ingredient too. 
I'll be honest, as much as I love cucumber, the concept of a cucumber sandwich kind of makes me want to throw up. But I, I, cucumbers are an auto add to the Subway sandwich 100% of the time. If I'm there, I'm getting cucumbers on the Subway sandwich. Now, here's the problem. I love a mantis, but what do we kill? It's not really a, it's not really a good mantis. Kill the pill bug? Well, then what do I sell? I can sell the cockroach, kill the pill bug? To get, kill a 5-7 that's our only strawberry upside to get 2-2? Uh, two, two? No, no, no. I think you stick... You dance with the one that brought you here. That's just my two cents. You dance with the one that brought you. And then we... We do get ready to sell the cockroach. Don't get me wrong. But it's got to be for the right unit, okay? It's got to be for the right price. Good shot. Good shot. We respect those shots. Did I lose my best units to make it happen? Yes. Am I scared? No, because we win these. I work at Subway. The amount of people who get upset when we don't have cucumbers is crazy. I get it. Everybody wants them. But because everybody wants them, we are guaranteed to run out. You know, I always love to hear from the, from the Subway employees. I always like to hear how the sausage is made. I am some... What do you think the most common topping added to the sandwich that's not cheese? It has to be... Lettuce, right? I'm trying to think of what comes second. Because I know tomato is second in the order. Like they used... I'm, I apologize for the aside, by the way. But I used to go to Subway and they'd say lettuce, tomato, red onion. That was like their, their pitch when they pulled it out of the toaster. Um, now... They're psychotic, and I don't blame the workers. I blame the, the corporation. I blame the management. When they pull it out of the toaster, they say everything on it. Are you fucking insane? Have you seen how many vegetables you have in front of you right now? It wouldn't be possible to close the sandwich if you put everything on it. That's, plus, you got lettuce and spinach. You got uh, hot peppers and jalapenos. Like, I don't need one of everything. Some things compete with each other. What do you think is the rarest topping? I feel like not that many people are getting the avocado. Like, the, the crushed avocado, crushed guacamole. Because it's an upcharge. You're wrong. The, tons of people get it. Olives are the least common. I feel like olives are like maybe least common, but when people want them, they, they really want them. Anyway, what the hell am I doing? I don't know. <laughs> Good question. I'm waiting for the next level, man. We might as well get some more juice out of this pill bug. Let's even move the puffin up so we get a nice buff here. I'll spend three gold to make our puffin a little better just for a second. Sure. You get spinach and lettuce? Like, it's not, I don't think you're crazy. I don't think you've like lost your mind or anything. It's just like, wow, just strictly worse. I'm a strictly worse gamer. I think it's too much of the same thing. But you know what? Maybe you're, maybe you're a volume-based eater. Maybe you like to crank the volume up in your car when you eat. Many people are saying this. Okay, pill bug, you gotta go. We, we, it's not a build around for a mantis situation. You kind of have to keep a jellyfish like in your back pocket here. I don't see any of this. I mean, okay, in, if you want to get a spy, we, You know what? We got enough HP. I bet we can make this work, okay? I, I think we can sell a cockroach. Buy a mantis. Mantis kills a blobfish. Kill it in front of the puffin. I'd rather double your damage at the start than um, get our jellyfish leveled up. I think a jellyfish is like a nice to have right now. Then the mantis is going to take a strawberry to make the puffin better as well. I'll give you my subway order. I got no problem with that. I'm, I'm not embarrassed too much. God, the math has been like so bad for us here. Ooh, I don't see how we could make it through this. This is, this is a problem, man. I get 
Uh, and you can judge my order because it's not it's the Franken chicken, but I just like how it tastes. Okay. I get the oven roasted chicken breast. Bread, I'm kind of bread agnostic. Whatever kind of bread is fine by me. Cheese, toasted. Do you even have to ask? That's the only reason I'm in the restaurant to begin with. Let me get lettuce, tomato, red onion, cucumber, um, pickles, olives, a little bit of yellow mustard. I'm trying to think if I miss anything. Or a little bit of hot sauce maybe sometimes. I, I don't mind it. I don't like the green pepper on a sandwich. It's just like I feel like the texture is... I love a green pepper, but it's firm and waxy enough to, to compromise the chew. No salt and pepper. I feel like a Subway sandwich without salt and pepper is already like 2,000 milligrams of, of salt. I've never seen the need to add a little salt and pepper on top of it. Always struck me as a little too decadent for my taste. Anyway, hold on. I got to focus. <laughs> we, completely unaware that I'm definitely going to die. Okay. Um, this, this provides us with very limited benefit. Maybe freeze a strawberry. Okay. Oh, no, this is nice. Okay, you get the level. You buff friends with no food. You're like a good animal to have in a pinch. I don't think we need a bird on this one. You're, you're like a good faintable. We don't need two of you, though. Let's not go crazy. Um, yeah, okay. Let's just have you along for the ride, honestly. Why did they even ask cheese and toasted? I There must be some sickos out there that... Uh, Let's go to the dream uh, the, the puffin. The dream puffin. There must be some sickos, sickos out there that prefer not toasted. And for health reasons, maybe people who are lactose intolerant. See, people would be like, no cheese. I can understand. The cheese... It, it adds a lot of flavor, but it also adds a lot of uh, a lot of calories relative to what you're getting out of it. But the, I'm with you on the toasted. The toasted is just a gimme. Okay, we've made it to the believer threshold. Can you believe it? Dude, you would summon... Hold on. Buy me? Sell me. Buff me? You're like the most likely to succeed. A stork at least will generate like a tier 4 unit on a faint, I think. Don't really need a lion here. Don't really need a triceratops. I, I understand how that sounds, but I, I stand by it. What about toasting tuna? I don't get the tuna sandwich. It scares me. It, it, it just seems like... Um, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. I know... Oh, come on, man. I know like a lot of people love it. They should really just call it, as we pay out the doubters here, they should call it a mayonnaise sandwich that has a little tuna added to it. This is huge. Let's take animals that have a chance to scale. Oh, like a cockroach, for example. <laughs> Let's not take mean bug. Be a wrinkled shirt. That's a great name. This is huge. 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 You got me thinking about sandwiches, though, man. Add me. Add me. An iguana, I sleep. But a second strawberry. No, what I was looking for was a bird. Thank you so much. I don't know if we need a second strawberry right now, but there's some, there's some positivity here. Two birds, one stone. I love it. I love it. Big money, big prizes. I love it. I almost had to turn off your stream because it's Passover and I can't have bread. Well, but have you considered that um, legally in Ireland, they can't call it bread because it has too much sugar in it. So I think in the eyes of the Lord, you actually might be okay right now. I uh, see. I'm turning it around. Every time you talk about Subway, people go, "You know, in Ireland, they legally can't call it bread." Yeah. Well, guess what? I think that means you're legally able to eat it. Oh, you also can't have cake. Okay. Well, then, in that case, <laughs> in that case, what do you have? Why not? Let's let's just give them a chance, man. 
All I have is this box of one dozen starving crazed weasels. All right, I'll take that. You know what I'm talking about? Holy cow. Here we go. I want to read this, okay? No, st don't stop. I want to read it. The, the fans deserve to have their, their say in court. As a fan of both yourself and Subway, I feel the need to fix your sandwich order. Lettuce and spinach goaded. Ditch your sauce setup and get Southwest with maybe some creamy sriracha. Get chicken strips instead of roasted chicken. 3x better. Look, I recognize... Here's it. People live in a world, and I, I appreciate the tip. People live in a world where if you're not going to eat a garden salad for lunch, you might as well eat like a Big Mac with 20 chicken nuggets. It might taste three times better, but it's also like 600 extra calories per foot long. Like yellow mustard is like 20 calories for two strips on a foot long. Every other sauce is like 150 to 200. Then you're replacing, you know, boiled chicken with, uh, with chicken strips. And that like, it's just, you get to the point where it's too much. So you got, you got to hedge your bets sometimes. That's the thing. A you go look at someone said a squirt of sriracha is not 200 calories. Yeah, motherfucker. That's why they call it creamy sriracha. I don't know what the hell they put in it, but it's, it's, it's like partially hydrogenated vegetable oil mixed with sriracha or something like that. Because that shit does not come out like a thin red line like Terrence Malick. It comes out like a, like a thick pink boy. I don't know what it is, but it's, they cream it up somehow. It's mayo and sriracha. That's why when I get the hot sauce, I get the Frank's Red. I put that er on everything. Okay, I'm still, I'm happy with where we stand here. I, I would love to have leveled up there. To be honest with you, I would love to have leveled up there, but that's okay. We don't really need another strawberry. I would roll here to fish for more levels in the future. I love that about this. I love that, sure. I'm feeling okay. I realize though, I have a lot of like actually bad food takes. Or let's not say bad, but food takes that are very much not in vogue right now. Like, for example, um, oh, we're so close, man. I, I think cucumbers are a great vegetable. I have no problem with Frank's Red Hot Sauce. I, I, people nowadays, they become so spice-pilled from watching so many Sean Evans videos. They're not, like, allowed to eat a hot sauce unless it's Cholula or is, like, it has a dude with smoke coming out of his ears. It was made from, like, a, a micro uh, batch... Carolina Reaper crossbred with uh, uh, Yucatillo Anaheim pepper. Uh, also, they sprayed like pure capsaicin on it when they were. Don't, 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 ooh, mm, you can really taste the fruitiness in it. No, you can't. You liar. Your face is like the color of a tomato right now. You could taste the fruitiness. People who say like Frank's just tastes like vinegar. I put vinegar on my food, so I'll put vinegar on French fries. I know it's kind of like a, a British plus northeastern U.S. eastern coast of Canada stuff, but fish and chips with some malt vinegar on the French fries, dude, it goes off. I put that on everything. So true. Dude, I'm going fat jellyfish here. Give me a dove. No dove. No dove. Um, these are all not that good. Um, you know what? Let's do this because we're going to hope to sell our cockroach soon, probably. So I'm just like, a, I'm not suggesting that like I have the only way to like do this. Like I've got, I'm the only person who knows how to like eat food. All I'm saying, I'm, you don't understand what the internet does is, is that you would think that it would be a great, um, I can't think of the opposite of the word, but it's the internet is like a homogenizer. The more time you spend on uh, like social media, the more you looked up hot sauce is ranked, the more you have a wide array of opinions and they all get shoved into a little lane of canonically acceptable opinions based on who the food writer of the Los Angeles Times is or something like that. Just because Eater.com did a blind taste test and Frank's came sixth out of, you know two sauces that doesn't mean it's not you know try it if you like it eat it cholula is great i mean cholula's is better than frank's in my opinion but sometimes i just want to go like you know what i mean 
Sometimes I just want to put a little, like a little squirt of uh, of Frank's on a pizza slice or something like that, and I'm and I'm happy to be there. Let me get, just let me see if the jellyfish can pop. There's a first time for everything. You're gonna make me go puffing again. I'm in hell. No, oh, I'm in whatever the opposite of hell is. Um, uh, Vancouver, uh, Las Vegas, heaven on Las Vegas. What is happening? Oh, my birds are not hitting the same unit. That's a problem. Yeah, we definitely lose this one too. Great song. Very true. Very true. Okay, this is... The pivot is very important here. This has to happen. I think you're both gone. Give me some permanent buffs. Add you to the squad just because you're good. Okay? You're just a great unit. It's just nice to have you around. We're going to roll a little. At this point, the doves give 1-1. One, one. We're probably not going to get another level up. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a bit of a gamble. I'm going to throw a hawk out here at the front. I wish that our hawk was not... Maybe it's okay at the front. Maybe it's... Okay, we lose this one. <laughs> yeah. All right. Dude, we've been getting our ass beat. Okay. Complete prediction. Start prediction. Run it back. I hate losing by round seven. Like, by round... I haven't even had a chance to, like, settle into the game by round seven, man. Okay, you know what? You take a mouse. You take a mouse, you take a duck because you have to take a duck. This squad is like actually horrendous right now, but just give us some time. Don't be a precious president. Who's a good president? They really do need to like finish the patch. I know that that's like extreme copium, but like only the biggest fucking nerds on the planet play the test build, myself included. That also includes mouth. Like we got to... Like, for real, get some normies back in the game. I'm just rolling, man. Come on. Give me give me something I already... You're not going to give me something I already have? You're going to get destroyed by normies? I mean, we've had data points for that for like six months. Every time I boot up the, the phone version, it's just free wins. People out here still running like, you know, turtle turtle whale. Okay, this is big. Hold on. This is big. We're not going to run strawberry. I think the clownfish is ass, but let's give it a try, okay? Big duckling. What a what a world we got here with a super duckling. I mean, if I'm going to combine you we might not yet, but we might as well make you kind of stronger than we had you. I just want to see one more mouse so that but then when the mouse levels up, who cares? Because we're gonna sell it. It has no merit. We win these. Why are you so ass? Okay, hear me out here. New strat. Sell me. Sell me. I'm oh, you gotta buy the apple first, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. New strategy. I'm gonna force the pivot, okay? We're buying a stork, because it's two units for the price of one. We're gonna add another duck to the squad. We're gonna basically we're rolling big duck. That's the damn. That, that's the spoiler for you. Okay, get ready because big duck is coming in. We're gonna add a two four to the squad because it's the best unit for now. What the hell is this? How did you make this team? Paid actor. Levels. Okay. I think maybe we can run a stork for the whole game. It scares me, but maybe maybe it's functional. 
Now I'll level with you. I think we freeze you. I'm adding an eel to the squad. It doesn't do anything yet, but maybe in the future. Okay, maybe with a cucumber on its side, it could get to something. Okay, should have sold the duck on the eel. I can't sell the duck. I agree like that. It activates the synergy that I want to see, but it just doesn't... Uh, it, it, it's not a part of my win condition right now because I need the duck in order to live. Okay. Now, you need that for sure. That's great news. Maybe we're saying you're gone. We don't need to worry about you anymore. Okay? You're always going to... We're going to need some of that. Always fresh at Tim Hortons. Now, we could... Here's... What would you rather have? A 5-3, which is actually a 5-5, five, five, or... A 2-7. I would rather have a 5-5, five, five, okay? Now, why don't you take this for now? Let's get you juiced up a little faster. I'm feeling like this stork is going to start to spit out some good units. Eventually. Stork me? What do you got? What do you got for me? A 2-2! Two, two, a, a guinea pig? It's nothing. We draw these? We win these? Holy cow. Holy cow. Somehow, despite our team's obvious problems, we're still hanging here. Now, you, if we get a mantis, like a mantis clownfish combo here, there's something going on, man. This is this is big. You level, you get a buff. You don't level yet. You suck. So I'll sell. And then I'll honestly just buy and then get ready to sell you. That's a great get. Thank you so much. Okay. Our eel is now like a 611. There's something to it. I'm still running an iguana build like it's like it's 1992. Okay, an Okapi didn't really do that much for us, honestly. The math is not in our favor. This is not the Hunger Games. I love seeing both doubters and believers being upset. Nobody knows how this one's going to go. And I'm in the same boat, man. Big duck? Freaking huge duck, maybe? 13, 14 duck? You might as well go to the front. I always think Sabretooth is going to be amazing and it's pure garbage. For the time being, let me be honest with you, I'll take an orangutan. And then you're going to give the lowest health pet one, two. I'm going to buff our freaking stork so that our eel gets that juicy bonus, okay? Oh, yeah, it's itself, itself. I forgot about itself. 2432 salamander, okay? That's... Um, like, really highly unfortunate. That's a strong team. How'd you do that? We're still alive, though. Selfish orangutan. Level me, please! <sighs> There's a part of me that says, look. You s I, do you trust me? You go full summon build. You sell your duck. You buy an orca. You sell your orangutan. You buy a vulture. And then you've got a full faint build. And by full, I mean you have a semi faint build. The vulture is going to get so much damage done if it lives, which is a bit sussy, I'll admit, but. Let's try. Order. What's wrong with the... There was an Anteater in there? That's a really good unit for this squad. Probably good enough for me to take, in my opinion. Okay, hold on. Vulture me. Good shooting. Good shooting. Here we go. G give me another Give me another good shot, please. Good shooting. Guess what? Guess what, baby? Move Orca? Why? Summons one random pet with a faint ability. Summons one random pet. Apologize. It can drop an anteater? Okay, don't apologize. Well, but then, like, none of these fuckers can be at the front. Hold on, you're gone. You stink. 
Terry WJ, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. You know what? You need to live through an attack no matter what. Probably will be a little happier with this. Keep you around for just a sec here. The eel might not do much for our synergy, but it's doing a lot for like us being alive, at least. I think that seems valuable to me. This is a full scumbag build. Believer threshold. Okay, that's why we got two vultures, baby. That's unfortunate. Or is it? Probably, yes, but hold on. What are we spawning? A whale. Okay, could be better. Could be better. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Believers. I was fighting for my damn life out there. Okay. I don't know even know why you're going to level up, but sure, let's do it. I mean, you're just insanely good. I definitely feel like giving a, like a Vulture an 11-11 buff seems kind of sick. But I also, I mean, I kind of feel like two Vultures is kind of poggy, but... Look, okay. One Vulture, 11-11 buff on the eel for now. It's going to be better. Okay, they... Oh, they got their own faint build! We got to kill their vulture, man! Shoot the vulture? Shoot the vulture, please. The vulture? I'm going to need you to shoot the vulture. Holy cow. I mean, they're not shooting my vulture either, so I guess I'm not crying. No, my green pepper. We win these! Level 2 Vulture, please. Please. Honestly, at this point, you do better with a green pepper, I think. I can't believe it. Seven wins. You're not necessarily... You know what? You need... You need, you need but what if you, you're, the, you're both tier 6, right? You're both tier 6? Six, 6? Six, tier 6? Tier 6? You just take one of those? Oh, baby. Let's get messy. Because it might... If they have a Vulture, we'd rather have this be earlier. You know what? You just take some freaking... You take some life. Choose life, train spotting. It's not a vulture build. Oh, uh, oh, oh. I'm feeling okay. Good snipe, good meaningful. It spawned an orca! Let's go! And then our orca spawned an orca. Do it, do it, you piece. Spawn and do a toucan, piece of crap. What a waste. Get sniped! Okay. Hold on, I'm pogging. Okay, I get that like when a friend faints, you give a 2-2 two -two buff. Way more interested in just basically getting popcorn. That's what I'm thinking. I want to see popcorn. I want to see units we've already gotten. I want to see popcorn. I don't think we need to buff you. I would love to see a level two vulture. That's what I, oh, two of these? Okay, sure, okay, sure, okay, sure, okay, sure. Summon two random pets with a faint ability. Let's keep you right there. I'm content with this. I'm, I, think the, I think the order is still okay, most of the time at least. Please, no vulture. They will have some some coconut armor, but we could shoot their coconut armor. We, okay, that's not that's not huge. Okay, coconut armor has been shot. This seems bad. You seem like really strong. Your team seems insanely strong, but we got a spider. Hold on. Your team seems really strong. Your team's insanely strong. They're the strongest team I've ever seen in my life. Okay, we lose these, but you know what? Still a pretty good game. Eight wins. I'll take it. Pay out the believers for once. I love the vulture. If we live till the vulture comes out, it's it's game over. I need a strawberry, please. See, yeah, you know what? Sure, let's roll a seahorse for now. Good day to be a believer. Well, not really. Let's be a dense bagel. It's no beignet, but still. That seems good.
Get buffed. Get bought for future gain. Oh, you're in a world of fucking hurt. You're done, bud. What happens when they flip upside down? That is the animation that triggers when they are moved. That's how you know they have moved. I mean, right now we're getting a 6-6 six, six buff on you. There's a part of me that says, you know what? Let's just get some early, easy wins. Like, I'm a simple man. Like, why don't we just do this? A little bit of this. Maybe we'll take a puff in just for a moment. See if we get another strawberry in the shop. Nothing here appeals to me that much. Second strawberry, sure. And you know what? For now, let's put a strawberry on a bird. So that all of our buffs are guaranteed to go to the seahorse, but we still get a little puffin benefit. Ooh. Ooh. One bird? Pathetic. Wait, some of the buffs can still go... Yeah, right, 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 okay. Some of the buffs can still go to the bird. You're not wrong. But one of the buffs is guaranteed to go to the seahorse. And that's what's really important in life. Okay, you know what? How about this? How about this? All right, let's, let's take a cassowary. Let's take a cassowary for the time being. Let's take another bird. And you know what? I shit you not, I was about to put a strawberry on a unit that already had a strawberry. Like I could get super strawberry powers. Um, let's put it on the puffin. I'm okay with that. The, the puffin gets to clean his own mirror. That's important. Imagine. The super berry. The boys and berry. Two birds. What kind of scumbag would run, would run two birds, man? Shit makes me sick. Okay, well, you know, it's a big pill bug. It happens. Right now, I'll go Cucumber Cassowary. Three wins, five rounds, eight HP. Not feeling bad. We roll for better units. We got better units. I'll buy you. I'll sell you. I'll run another bird. 2-1 with the 2-2 buff. Freeze a Kiwi. It's going to be really confusing if they ever add Kiwi the fruit in here. I invented the big pill. What's, Malph, what's the big pill? What is happening? <laughs> Holy cow, we draw. Let me show you. What the heck? Is this allowed? Go hard on tanking big pill? What is this even? Oh, okay. You're saying it's a pill bug. I thought it was like a, a way to get like a super pill that you invented or something like that. Go hard on tanking, big pill. What about two cassowaries? How come your mom lets you have two cassowaries? With the weak one in front for some reason. Yeah, here we call it mean bug, okay? Are we back? We're winning? We're winning games? Four wins. I gotta remember, when the Believer's points are on the line, don't pivot till you get to six. <laughs> if you got good things going on, just keep them going. Be nice to the Believer's. I don't really want to run two cassowaries long term, but for now, sure. We don't really, I mean, honestly, I mean, I'm not interested in, the, in a seahorse improving. Another strawberry? I, I mean, I, I, feel, I can't help but feel like we don't really care about our puffin right now. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll spend three gold on one gold. And then when we combine, we'll make sure to probably keep the cucumber, but... That unit is too strong. Both, uh, they have two units that are way too strong. Headstrong, they'll take you on. We weren't up by too much, that's okay. And we're not even close to lethal yet. Animal fighting game? Squeaks, I just got back from a very exhausting vacation. If you could not be toxic in chat, that would like really help me out a little bit. Let's keep the grape, man. 
Anteater is an always take. You know what? Sure. And then roll me. Come on, man. The toads are great. Don't get, I was just looking. I was matching. I was just looking for animals we already had. Okay, dog. What is this? Like, this is the kind of nerd you go up against the present state of the game. Are you kidding me? They had a pug that turned a panda into a level two panda, triggered exactly perfectly so that the dog went before the panda, so that the panda fed the buff ahead. It's insanity. Okay, there's a way out of this, though. You buy a fox. It's that simple. You get the fox to buy distributed foods. That's not good enough. You don't really want it to eat a strawberry, honestly. A distributed food? I'd rather it didn't eat a green pepper. There's not that many distributed foods I'm realizing right now. I'm just rolling. I'm literally just rolling. I'm, I'm just rolling. Okay. I'm rolling. I'm still rolling. We want you to have this. Please don't eat a strawberry. You, if you eat soup, I won't cry myself to sleep tonight. How does that sound? Not the most efficient use of our, of our gold, but that's why we get a grape. Okay, nice little taco. I can't believe our anteater got sniped both times. Holy cow. Holy cow, we're still alive. Let's go, baby. Now... Honestly, it's really hard to get rid of a 10-10 seahorse. I, the Komodo's got to be more than 1-1. One, one. That's my two cents. Double soups? I could, be, I could be persuaded. I could be persuaded to sell this seahorse, but it's got to be something good. And none of this is good enough. I recognize that the pelican is pretty good, but I don't think it's as good as a 10-10. Okay, nice. Nice little distributed health buff. It could happen. Our team is kind of weak, but it could happen. 30, 24 yak. Not exactly ideal. I think we're going to win, though. I actually think we won. That's the creme de la resistance. Look at that. Believers win. You don't really need a grape anymore. You probably need a green pepper. You're like the only animal on our team doing anything. Um, Stegosaurus, kind of like necessary, kind of goaded, kind of necessary. Let's buff you with, uh, let's buff the cassowary and look for distributed foods. How much do you trust me? No, oh, you have 6-6. Six, six. You're good enough. Hold on. Roll me. T totally fine. Roll me once more. Nothing special. Two foxes. Uh, or level 1.5 fox, I should say. We got the hot dogs out there. Castleberry's getting stronger. I'm feeling okay. Why green pepper on that unit? Would you rather I put it on any of our other units for whom every single one of their stats is lower than the stats on the unit you didn't like it being played on? I mean, it's like it's, it's got better... When you consider the Stegosaurus buff, it's got better stats than... in every category than everybody. So it won't get one shot? Yeah, but what are the consequences if it does get one shot? Our whole squad craters. It won't, though? That seems like... That's source dude, just trust me. Whenever people say, like, oh, it won't, I'm like, yeah, okay. They said they'd never put a man on the moon either, and you saw how that went down. Distributed foods? I don't really want to buy a cucumber. I'd rather just keep rolling this, man. Come on, come on. Okay, a distributed food. I'll live with that, and then we roll once more. Another fox, maybe. I mean, the anteater is probably getting pretty close to, like, we don't need this territory. You believe that they did that? 
I had, and I, look, I'm not a conspiracy theorist at all. Here's my conspiracy theory. Most things in life, in the world, in history, have happened roughly as we believe they've happened. At least with respect to most of the, the big conspiracies. That's my conspiracy theory, is that... Well, it's not really fair, because once a conspiracy theory, like, gets proven, then it just becomes fact. <laughs> so it's kind of, I guess it's like a tautology to say that, like, I don't believe in any conspiracy theories, because if they find evidence, then it's no longer a conspiracy theory. But, hold on, I almost paid out the doubters, because I was talking there. But I had a friend 